Hey guys, Hicks here. If you're looking to improve your aim and to find the right sensitivity, this video will show you how to use the PSA tool, which helps each person individually find their own perfect sensitivity. And I'll walk you through each step now. So to begin, bring up custom games and create a new custom. And then in settings, import this code VAXTA. So this is a aim training platform and uh, we use this to test each of the sensitivities. Now, the other thing you'll need to do is open up the PSA method calculator that I've put in the description of the video. So once you've got the workshop open, um, you'll choose a character. I found Cassidy to be a good one for this. And then shoot the button that says start warm up. So we need to find our base sensitivity we're going to use. And to do that, you need to focus on a part of the wall that stands out, such as this line. And then you need to find the sensitivity that gives you a full 360 by swiping your mouse from the left side of your mouse pad to the right. I've found with 1600 DPI, it should be around 2.5 in-game or around 5 in-game for 800 DPI. If you need to test this and work it out, maybe pause the video now and come back when you've got it. So now we need to put this base sensitivity into the PSA calculator and this will give us our starting sensitivity at the top left. So enter whatever the number is you got for a full 360 and on the right hand side it will bring up a table that gives you a lower sense and a higher sense to try. So we'll try both of these and then on the left hand side we select the button for which one we can aim better with in games, lower or higher. So I start off by using the lower sense, which in this case was 1.25, which is really slow for what I usually use. Um, I felt the mouse was really heavy, so it definitely wasn't going to be close to where I had to be. But still I give it a little bit of time to make sure. And then once I've tried this out a little bit, what I do is move on to the higher sense. So now I swap to the higher sense, which was 3.75. And as you can see, this is way too fast and I just can't hit anything at all. So at least with the lower sense, I was still able to hit targets, even if my mouse felt like a brick and was super sluggish. So in this case, what I do is I go back to the PSA calculator and I choose the lower sense because it worked a lot better than the higher sense. And then it will give me two new values to try, as you see here and I head back into the game and try these out. So starting with a lower sense is going to be 0 0.94. Now with this video I have had to shorten it down quite a bit to not be too long of a video. I'd suggest definitely giving it maybe at least two or three minutes for each sensitivity. Um, unless it's super obvious it's just not going to work. Um, you definitely need some time to adjust your muscle memory to each new sensitivity. Um, because this one's even slower than the previous one, uh, it's definitely not going to be the sense for me. Um, so I go ahead and move over to the higher sense now. So as you can see it does take a little bit of adjustment but this one definitely feels better as I'm not dragging my mouse halfway across my mat in order to aim. Um, it's definitely not good aim yet um, but yeah definitely I would say the higher sense in this case was the better one for me. So we pretty much go back to the tool and repeat the same thing and we'll go ahead and choose the higher sense which will give us uh, two new values again. So pretty much you keep going through and repeating this and then after the eighth iteration it will give you your final sensitivity. Um, just make sure that each time you're making a good decision and um, actually trying each sensitivity pro properly. Um, each time you give it an answer the range between the two numbers will decrease um, but as you can see it does eventually give me a perfect sensitivity of 1.80 and then I head back into the workshop with the new sensitivity and just give it a warm up. 
like I said, it does take a little bit of a time time to adjust your muscle memory. Um, after doing a warm up here in the workshop, I suggest taking it into quick play and actually giving it a shot in the game. Um, it does take a while to adjust if you've been using another sensitivity for a really long time. Um, but definitely suggest giving it some time and trying to get used to it because it has improved my aim drastically over, over the course of time. Um, and I believe this is probably the main thing that took me from Diamond to GM. So give it a shot and see how it works for you. Let me know in the comments if it has improved your aim. And give me a like and subscribe if you found this helpful. Thanks again for watching guys.